what's up um this is a new youtube video as you guys can see why wow, my hair is messed up whatever if you guys saw in my title this is my top five um shoes and it's summertime of 2017 so like my list is gonna change my list changes all the time which is shoes with shoes but um let's just get right into it these are my top five shoes right now at this moment so first, at my number five spot, we have these, not Air Force ones, those are right over there, but inside this box, they're really trashy right now because they went through some heck, I had these for like about almost two years, but these are my Nike Roshis, they're really, really nice, I think I got them for like 70 bucks or something, so pretty good. This mesh material is amazing. Just make sure, like, if you want this shoe with, like, this type of mesh. It's not, like, a shiny. It's, like, really, like, hard and dense. Or not hard. It's just, like, really thick. Like, I don't know. But make sure to get your actual size. Maybe even, no, not, do not go half a size up. Just stick to your normal size. Because... These are sixes, and now I'm a seven and a half. And right here, the toe is starting to rip because um, they're just falling apart. And here, my dog got that. I was really mad at her, but here's like some of the lacing off of the laces is coming off. You know, the tip of that's gone. That's all one. That one's all messed up. But rather than that, like, oh, in the creases. Like, when you crease them, mine, my pair, they started to rip. Like, can you guys see that right there? They all, they started, like, the mesh started ripping and stuff. But all that, it started just tearing and ripping apart. But the traction, the traction is actually decent. Like, it looks pretty bad. It wears out super duper quick, but... These ones, I had these for two years, and they actually, like, they held up super, super good. But, maybe that was just my luck or something, but... The traction on a scale 1 to 10, 10 being the greatest of all time, I'd give it, like, a... 7, no, 6, 6 and a half. It's actually, it's pretty good, do not play basketball in them, though. Then you will roll your ankle and just die. So... Number four on my list is probably, and some of these shoes, most of the shoes I do not have, just because I don't have them, and I'm not rich, but my number four spot is the Adidas NMDs. I really like the triple black version. I think it's going to be like right here, right there. This little box is going to be a picture of them, but... I just really like them. I've seen on videos and stuff that they're just really, really good. And they feel they're comfortable as heck. I don't know how the traction is because, again, I don't have the shoes. But um, if I could give it, like, what I've seen in videos. And I'm getting most of this stuff from the Soul Brothers. If you guys want to go check out them, you guys can. They're like... They talk all about shoes and does it basketball and does it still basketball, like shoes and stuff. They're really, really cool. So, that's, um, that's in my number four spot, the Adidas NMDs. In my, um, number three spot, probably going to be the Ultra Boosts. The Ultra Boosts, I, the uncaged version. I hate the cage version. It just does not look good, in my opinion. It just... Mm -mm. I don't like how the caged version looks on the Ultra Boost. With the uncaged version on the Ultra Boost, um, I really like it. I like the ones I saw it on the GOAT app, if you guys know it. It's another, like, sneaker type app. You can buy Yeezys and all that. You have the Ultra Boost, the 3.0s. They're, like, I'll, again, I'll have a picture, like, sitting right here, right, right on my hand. With the Ultra Boost that I want. Or what I like. And I've also heard that the traction, just like these Roshis, the traction is like good, but it all it wears down pretty quick. And that's the same with my, um, are we in number three? 
I think we're on number three. But my number two spot, the chair action just sucks. The number three spot, Ultra Boost 3.0s. The Adidas Ultra Boost. Uncaged. The third one is, or the second one is, this. You see that? You see what that says? This is Nike Air Force One. These shoes, I do have the box because I literally just got these. These things are nice. Like these, oh man. The mesh, I I first got super duper mad because they these are not slip on shoes. If you think that you're just gonna quick unloosen the strap, untie them, slip in, no. These shoes though, it's a Velcro. And this actually does stuff. Like it actually holds your ankle. Pretty good, it's pretty good ankle support. But at the ends, that's like one of my favorite parts. At the end, it's metal. It's like a metal like cap. So this thing doesn't fly everywhere. Not like the Roshis, where it's like this plastic piece of junk. As you guys can see, that's what happens. Just tears apart. That's a that's no. Oh, these laces are super duper short. I don't know how that happened. But it's that's that's a pain. That's a really big pain when that gets undone off the thing. Every single time I gotta use like a pen or something and jab it in. But um, right here, the uh these are the these are seven and a half. I suggest going true to size again. You guys cannot see these, can you? But like they're like a really nice. They're palm green. Which is, in the pictures, it said that they were lime green, or palm green, but they're palm green, black and, and black and white. They, these did not look green at all on the Nike website, so Nike fixed that. But, um, yeah, they're actually pretty nice. But the traction, these, bro. Number two, the traction, dude. Trash. It is terrible. Like, just slides right off. These little like I don't know if you guys can see it but there's a little like notches that are way grippier than the whole rest of the shoe and the same with the heel there's little notches right there and it, that's like actual like really good rubber it's pretty decent rubber so that definitely holds up <laughs> and that's like the most grippiest part of the shoe and you can maybe see some creases and stuff like right there of like you know this is kind of like Nike Air they say or something like that as it says right there, air, it's backwards, but it's alright. But, yeah, it's like, you guys take a better look at these notches. You can see, like, right there, you see how it, like, ends? It just comes up. That's, like, the grippiest part of the shoe. Same with the heel right there. And the heel part actually comes up pretty far. It comes up to, like, almost this little, like, line of the Nike Air. But these are, if you're going to get the palm green version... If you do not like green, do not get these. These are, these are green, like, really, really green. These are my, gonna be my school shoes, like, as you can see, like, these little holes. Like, the holes, like, right there, these little holes are really green. So, and, but, that's, you know, I just gotta deal with it. But, like, they're just, they're really, really nice. And these are my number two spot. And this ankle strap, it does good. So, number two spot. Now, don't hate, alright? But, my number one spot. It's going to be right here. The red, the core black and red stripe Yeezys. Okay? Kanye West Adidas Yeezys 350 Boost V2s. Ooh. Okay? And they're just... They're the greatest Alright, sorry about that. My phone ran out of space. Pretty sure you guys know what Yeezys look like. If you guys don't, I don't know where you guys have been. But, yeah, that's my shoes. The Yeezys, like, they just, oh, they look so nice. And they're so, like, people say that they're so comfortable. And, like, the prime knit and stuff is just so nice. So nice. But this shoe, this shoe's, like, close, though. My Air Force Ones. I want to get the um, rainbow color and the red color of the Flynets, Ultra Flynets. If you guys were wondering, like, on the um, Air Force ones, it's all backwards. I'll read it to you guys. 
it's so I got a seven and a half, my true two size. Um uh for retail. Retail, this is ridiculous. 150 bucks. And I got them for like 105. So that was pretty good. And um so they're Nike Air Force Ones Ultra Fly Knit. These are the mids. These are the mid. Um the special force Air Force Ones. I want those bad, but they're really expensive. But yeah, again, these are the palm green and black and white version. And for retail, it's 150 but I got them for um, 105 or something like that. So, yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, give it a like. Give it a, I was about to say thumbs up, but likes and thumbs up are the same thing. Um, subscribe if you guys haven't already. And tell me what you guys thought of the intro. That took me like 20 minutes. I'm not gonna lie. Everything on all messed up. Alright, I'm rambling. I'll see you guys in my next video. Post in the comments or show in the likes if you guys like these type of videos because I can definitely make more. So my next one might be basketball shoes or something like that, you know? Or, I don't know. Leave comments in the comments and to tell me what I'm like, what I should do next. So, if you guys enjoyed this video, give it a like and subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video. Goodbye.